Greetings humans, and welcome back to another video. I'd like to say this time I'm actually quite impressed with myself, because for the first time since I started this whole YouTube thing, there was an update, and I checked that my microphone was working first, which it wasn't, but because I checked, it means this time I haven't filmed an entire video before finding out, I filmed a 30 second test and found out. So we are making progress people, we are making progress. But on that note, welcome back. The sun is shining, as you can probably see from the shine on my face. It, it's the first time. Yesterday it was freezing. I was in, over at, in the office. Which makes me sound like I do stuff far more professional than I am. I wasn't. I was hanging out, preparing stuff for kids' work. But it, either way, it was freezing. There was a radiator, and I spent a lot of time hugging the radiator. It was minus three degrees when I left the house yesterday. Comparatively, today, it might just be the time inside, but the sun is shining, I'm warm, I washed my hair and the sun dried it. We are living the life of luxury here, folks. This is delightful, and I love it. However, since it's warm, hydration is way more important. So, hydrate, take a seat, and enjoy. As you can see up there, this month, this this month. <laughs> Today we're doing this month's yarn from Good Vibes thing. I worded that badly. Although, once again, I have a confession. I have already opened the yarn, and not only that, I've already used some of it because I have the patience of a mosquito. So, we're going to get into it, but I'm also going to show you the progress on what I've made with it. Sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. Starting off with, well there goes that label, two balls of this stuff, which I like. Look at, look at the colours. We've got pretty, pretty yarn, which I love. And some not, it's nice, it's quite autumnal, but I've also got two balls of that, so I like it. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. As always, if you have a suggestion, please tell me. I've just realised I've done the same thing as I did last time. I'm going to move my mouse, because last time I filmed a video like this, I managed to stop myself recording by dropping a ball of yarn. So, my mouse is moved, so I shouldn't manage that today. As always, apologies for the crinkles. We've got these two, which are actually quite similar shade-wise to the thicker stuff. Got sort of browny, orangey, greeny stuff in both of them. I feel like not the most interesting colours, but also it's not like they're horrible. I'll find something to do with them, probably. And we got a piece stitch marker. But it's not gonna lie, it's probably bigger than I'd actually use. Okay, despite moving my mouse, I managed to stop myself recording. I haven't quite worked that one out yet. Probably I'll, I ought to stop putting stuff on my keyboard. But fear not, next week I'm going to IKEA. I will be getting a new desk and hopefully then I will stop stopping myself recording. So, wish me luck with that. And the final thing I got in the bag was these. Except I actually started with, I believe, eight of them. And I've now got five remaining and a half over there. And they are going towards this. He still needs a face. Well, he still needs eyes. And he's going to have a sword and shield because he is actually going to be Link from The Legend of Zelda, but in bunny rabbit form. He also needs a tail. I haven't done his tail yet. But he is in progress and I love him already. He is adorable. I'm probably going to have to get rid of him because I don't have space. But I might see if I can find space because right now I wasn't... At first I wasn't sure, but then I did his nose. I know I really love his nose and I love him and I want him, so I might need to find a good home. I might see if I can find space for my home to be a good home. <laughs> but it did make me think, maybe I should show some other things I do with the Good Vibes yarn. I can't show huge amounts because most of my projects are in Happy New Homes. However, I have been making some granny squares which should be going towards a big blanket but all of these have been in mystery bundles not necessarily mystery bundles since i started recording because some of this yarn is quite old but all of these have been made 
in fact all of these have been made with three forms with some left over but yeah that's my current one for brawls as i don't quite have enough of anything to do with in fact they've all been used with these three actually that one may have been from a different place but these two are definitely good vibes this one may have been from elsewhere can't remember because i've had it for quite a long time this one was the pinky orange one but held double with just a plain speckled white rather than the other one from there but yeah just thought it might be interesting to show a bit of what i do with some of the extort no some of the huge amounts of yarn i actually have gathered some of the yarn i will say has gone to a local primary school because they use a lot of it for their weaving projects and they've got various projects that require yarn of different colors and patterns and designs so some of it that i don't use has gone there quite a lot of the roving stuff has gone over there so that they've got an interesting texture and some of the stuff where i just go yeah <laughs> on the color goes to them just because at the end of the day if they can use it for learning brilliant I don't, I think all of those that I've got this month will be used for something. I can't guarantee what that something will be, but it will be something. And hopefully something either interesting, relatively pretty, or both. So if you have any suggestions, feel free to offer them. At some point I'm going to need to learn how to make socks, because I've got sock yarn coming out of my ears. So if you have any suggestions for places where I might find decent sock patterns, let me know, because I do need to learn how to make them at some point. However, until then, see you later. Thanks for watching. Tell the little computer on YouTube that you like me by liking the video. Comment. Subscribe if you'd like to see more yarny nonsense from me. Remember to hydrate and enjoy the sun whilst it still shines. Bye.